Hey, this is my game Sneak Thief. I uh, just wanted to give a brief overview of what goes on in here. So, main game, there's 50 levels. Um, each one's unique, fun. Uh, difficulty definitely ramps up the first time there's sort of an intro. Um, but basically, the point of the game is to find the gem in each level. Uh, these are power switches that you can turn on, and as you can see, uh, they follow those little white dots. That's where the power uh, is carried. And this one turns on a laser and a light. This one opens up that door there. Um, yeah, that's uh, that's the point. So you you turn on these different things. The lights show boxes and the uh, the gem when you turn them on and once you collect the gem you've completed the level um, so yeah that's that's the main game right there there's 50 different levels lots of fun uh, now the custom levels there's five different custom levels that you can create yourself I included the editor that I used to make the game uh, as you can see, play, edit, delete. So if you had something there, you can play it. Uh, I'll show you how to use this here. Uh, so you can put down each of the five blocks, the empty space, uh, walkable space with power, wall, wall with power, and then the trap tile that, when you walk over, turns into a wall. Uh, basically, you just sort of make a little level. Don't really have to surround it like this, but I'm going to do that. Uh, pressing the O key gives you the boundary for the map. Uh, P puts down the player, 1 through 5 put down the tiles, and then with Q, W, and E you can put down uh, items on the blank tile, and then ASDF put down the items that are powered when you turn on the, uh, the switch here. The Z key you can use to show that uh, like a, a, a power power source like this will be turned on at the beginning of a level. Um, red means it'll be turned on from the beginning. White means it won't be. And then with a the box, you can cycle through the different items to be put in there. And if you want to just leave it empty, you can do that. So let me make a quick little level here. I think this one should work. If not, we can edit it. Yep. And then if you wanted to edit, you can always go back in and say I wanted to make it bigger. Uh, go over here. I can add a giant area here. I don't know, you get you get the idea. Um, pressing escape uh, saves and quits and this up here means that there is currently a level there and to delete it just press delete it's removed completely so be careful with that if you don't want to delete things um, one cool thing is that the editor allows you to make a map of I think 50 by 50 tiles None of the main levels are that big, uh, just for sanity's sake. Um, but if you wanted to make something giant and complicated, you could do that. It's excellent. Uh, I highly advise it. Uh, and then you can share the maps by sending the files back and forth with friends. And that's basically the game right there. Um, as you can see, there's 50 levels, 50 gems to collect, and uh, not really anything more than that, I guess, but uh, that should be enough to be interesting. So, that's the game, Sneak Thief.